Hello and welcome to the Gage Look, and we're back in total war with Bretonia, Bretonian Crusade for the New World. Now guys, there's quite a lot going on. I'm under siege in my capital. Uh, I believe I'm under siege down here, or did I break that? No, I broke that. We're under attack from every elven faction, I think, apart from the actual wood elves. We're trying to build up armies with the Fae Enchantress, and we were building up an army with Albrecht. Um, this is a bit of a problem for me up here, I think. I have considered fighting this. I think I might auto-resolve this right now, though, because I think it would be better for me to do that, because they have an insane amount of Chaos Trolls. Yeah, that went reasonably well. Okay, so we've broken that. But let's not pretend that's over yet. They've got those three stacks. There's two... Well, there's one stack of Beastmen plus another force. I think that's Kazrak himself, so I'm sure... He will be trying to hurt me in some sort of horrendous way soon. Uh, what shall we get here? I think we'll just get you a couple more swordsmen. And we could do a couple more knights for you as well. Let's just get some... It should be enough just now. Okay, so Albrecht's leveled up. Um, oh. Maybe we should think about some foot squires for him. Yeah, he does have some different things, doesn't he? Although I do think they should do more with Albrecht. I don't think he's got enough. Okay, that'll do just now. Um, Maybe I'll get three sets of squires in. I realise they take up peasants, but it might be better for me in the long run. Um, Okay, so what are we going to do here? Oh yeah, and just so you know, I've been reading my comments. There's been some great interaction and great views happening on this. Uh, which is terrific. It's definitely my most popular series. I have a comment from Ben. I thank you, Ben, for commenting. We will call our next... What are they again? Are they Prophetess? I can't even remember. Damsel. Um, my beast... I intend to get a beast damsel. I'll probably stick it with Albrick, and when it levels up high enough, I'll probably change it around with Luon. And we will call them Bell, as your suggestion. Any suggestions for name characters, let me know, or any units... Let me know. I'm really happy. I quite enjoy naming things. It makes them a bit more worthwhile, I, I feel, when at least when I'm playing. That's my interpretation of things. Now, the big question for me here is should I go south with Luon? I think I'm going to have to. Because I don't think she's good enough. So, I can't go anywhere with you right now. Don't I have another army as well? I do. Question. Mm, north or south? There's all these little buggers running around as well. Okay, so there's not really much going on in this turn. Um, I wouldn't mind piecing out with a few people. I'm quite happy to stab the elves in the back later. <laughs> Sounds awful, but, you know, they you lied about the lady. You seek a pact well, probably not you lot. Defender of the Your presence is not appreciated. Do you know what would be handy? I'm thinking some of you guys play Europa Universalis as well. And there's now new options, or a new menu, which shows you what factions would accept what option. So something like who would accept a peace treaty in a list, that would be great. Absolutely great for this. Or maybe the likelihood, maybe not definite, because that takes the fun a wee bit away from it. But um, yeah, I think that would be good. Let's just get control everywhere. I mean, I'm going to lose a couple of these towns again. I'm pretty confident of that. Of course, the Vampire East, which we are going to have to do something about. I think that will be Albrecht's cause, but... I don't know. I think eventually I would like... The Fae Enchantress down south, Luon to go west, probably just ignore the north mainly, and Albrecht to go east. We need to crusade against those goddamn elves. I have money, I have forces, but it's it's just a spread out kingdom, Bretonia. Oh, come on. End turns can be a bit dry. Yeah, you're getting great interaction, good likes, good comments in this video. So please, this video series, I should say, please keep commenting. I, I very much enjoy making this one. It probably comes across like that as well. Uh, Bretonia is by far my favourite faction. And I'm looking forward to it. I will be starting another campaign with uh, Rome Total War, or Rome Total War 2, The Empire Divided. And that will be in a couple of days, or a day or two, depending on when I release this video. And I'm not sure who I'm going to go with that yet. Um, I'll probably wait to see 
what the big YouTubers, Total War YouTubers, like Lionheart and thing, do and then do the opposite to what they do, just to have something a little bit different. But hopefully you're looking forward to that. It'll be strange not fighting with heroes and things though. Ah, I don't know how I'm going to... It's just going to be a bit odd. I'll fight that on vanilla, I think. I, I won't put any mods. Obviously, I'm using the Radius mod on this. Uh, I'm not sure Radius will make a mod for Empire Divided. Uh, but I think even if he did, I think, or if they do, I will probably play it on vanilla for the Let's Play purposes. Any suggestions on that, though, let me know. Or if anybody's interested in doing a, a multiplayer campaign, also let me know. Okay, let's have a look. Burn the witch. Oh, that sounds good to me. Okay, so we have a lot of enemies. We really, really do. Ostland is gone. The Varg are pushing in. Now, oh, I've got the unification of Brotonia. I don't think that matters anymore. Although I believe it does help some other item, doesn't it? Okay, let's deal with technology first. Is there a way to fight else? It's just wood elves, wasn't it? Uh, let's just get the ruinous powers at the moment. Okay, Luon. By the light of the lady. It's about time we cause some trouble for these bloody elves. Oh, that was probably a mistake. God damn it! The nation calls, Lord. We are at war with you, yes we are. Of course we are. Okay, we could definitely do... I don't need all these recruitment buildings everywhere. What I want is some defensive buildings. Leonese. So you're another one. You definitely need some more troops as well. So let's get you another King's Own Swords. I will indulge you. And we could do a couple more archers. In fact, shall we get our... Yeah, let's get our... Fleet-footed. Yeah, that's probably really good, actually. Okay. You shall be called... Bale. And I think your surname... Will be Bane. And you will know why, for the person who asked. I have seen your heart. Obviously, I can change the, the surname from the request from the same person as well. So just let me know. Um, I hear the wind. Oh, you're such a pain, all you lot. There's so little I can do. Blessings of the lady be upon you. My strength and wisdom are yours. So I think we'll get rid of some of you lot. Protector of the realm. Do you know who I am? I'm definitely over my peasant limit. <laughs> Oh, I, I need to do some damage to these bloody elves. I'm not so worried about this location. And... Why won't you just peace out with me? And these are good armies as well. I've already beaten Tyrion in the field. Certainly not. I thought I was Tyrion again. I mean, I, I should be able to beat that easy enough. Their archers will be a pain in the ass, but you know, flying cavalry and stuff. Um, yeah, sure. you got stacks and stacks of people here, though. You really do. Three different types of cavalry, that's that is annoying. Okay, let's see if we can get one big battle in this episode. I'm fairly confident something's gonna come our way. If I remember rightly, we've got green skins to deal with again, because the bloody was it the wood elves that liberated them? Something ridiculous. I do like this trait gained mechanic, I think that really adds to the game. I'm not going to fight that battle. God damn it. Should I fight that? I think I should fight that. Okay, so what have you got? You've got minus five leadership. Let's stick that on your knights. Uh, you have quite a lot of archers and you have quite a lot of cavalry. And I do not have a lot of cavalry. I have a lot of archers. Yeah, let's fight it. What sort of territory? Why can't I see the terrain when I'm getting attacked? Strange. So I've got Paladin. Uh, I've got the Fae Enchantress. 
My cavalry will be better than their cavalry, I imagine. I better double check that. Okay, and I did have a suggestion. Again, I think it was from Ben, so thank you. That pausing a little bit more is fine. I've been struggling a little bit playing as these guys, uh, Bretonia that is, without pausing. And it's mainly just because there's so much micro to do when there's a lot of cavalry. I would say that in this particular battle there probably isn't as much a need due to the, the lack of cavalry on my side. Although we will need to start off a little bit micro. I am going to do a bit of corner camp here, you've already guessed, but I think that is fine when I have artillery superiority. I do have kind of archer superiority as well, um, but not necessarily better archers. Is my paladin mounted? He is indeed. So I think all my cavalry can get in the back here. We'll remind me, Quest of Knights are living saints, which is great. Anti-large and just some good infantry. Do you have much in the way? No, you've got hardly any magic at the moment. Okay, I will pause it immediately, just to be annoying. And stick some trebuchets at the back there. Four. And I think we'll try and do a little something something, as they say. With the crossbowmen on the edge here. We will see how that works. But let's put them there at the moment, just as a normal lot of archers. And Bretonian macemen, I think we will try and charge out with you a little bit. Uh, you guys just stay in rank there. The Enchantress, if you can go there. Okay, a little bit of boring battle, I realise. She does look cool though, doesn't she? Favour of the lady. Oh, that's pretty good actually. Oh, that's right, she causes damage to people all around her, so you get in the front line. Stay back a little bit. Don't worry too much. And you lot can all be one group as well. I'm presuming you're just going to walk up on me. No way you could see me. So what sort of cavalry do these guys have? They have Alurian Reavers, which will be faster than my cavalry, no doubt. They have Silver Helms, which are decent, actually. They're more... I don't know, man, better than them. The Reaver Archers, that that is a problem. Shore Riders, which are must be from the Radius, but they're pretty damn good, actually. But they don't have any anti-large cavalry, which is what I was worried about. Which means I have... I'm not going to say cavalry superiority, but I have an advantage over them. Okay, let's just... I think what we'll do here... Is we'll keep you guys... In. I know this looks a bit confused, and it is a little bit, but I, I think I know what I'm doing. I'm going to try and charge out on that flank, you see. So I'm just going to wait this a little bit more on this side. And you know, these Bretonian men-at-arms are, um, are not so bad either. Okay, I would like you guys to fire in to the Illyrian archers if possible, although I don't see them anywhere. There you are, little buggers. You're going to go out of my range, actually, aren't you? That's a shame. One, one load off, maybe? Yes. Well, of course, it's blessed as well. Nice. Okay, let's just fire into your archers. I am a little bit worried about this archer superiority they've got. I'm hoping enough of their frontline troops charge in that it becomes a bit erratic for them. I am going to try and get my crossbowmen out on one of the flanks as well. But we'll see. Could have done well a wee bit more cavalry. Right, okay. Focus on the light armor archers. Probably their best archers, I imagine. I mean, they're charging straight into spearmen. Which is great, I suppose. 
Uh, can I reach most of you guys? Okay, let's pause. First pause. Sorry. Let's just reach into you. I am the same. It does a wee bit of damage, I think. I'm not really that worried by any of this. Prince is a wee bit concerning. Okay, I, I say we just get a cavalry straight over. Let's do it. Let's do some healing here. What can you guys reach? Fire at that. Can you guys reach? Fire at that. Fire at that. Fire at that. Fire at that. And that. Should do with them easy enough. I would hope. If you can fly straight into the back of them, that'd be nice. I'm not getting my charge that I wanted, mainly because of Prince here. Well, that wasn't quite what I meant to do. He can fly out there. They have demolished my front line, actually. Okay, where are my Knights of the Realm? If you can fly into them. You guys fly into them. Yeah, I should have the advantage. Okay, I'm going to pause for a second. Get you guys back. Where's my lady? Okay, you're not in the best, the best position for me. If you can come back. If you can do some damage in there. Okay, that should be fine. I don't think my paladin will have anything now. Yeah, so the anti-large has done its business down here, hasn't it? Jeez, oh. Those arrows look a wee bit strange, but it's fine. Okay, Enchantress, you here? You are here. Do some healing there. Oh yes, of course. Um, yeah, do plus 40 melee attack right there. Oh, these archers are really doing some damage to me. Let's just deal with them quickly, shall we? Okay, get back into them, you guys get into the archers. Paladin, if you can just try and deal with that. I would like to get... Oh, there's spearmen there, I never even noticed. You know what, might be? it might be worth just coming out a little bit here. Fate, you can get there. A little bit of damage to this lot. Cavalry's not done great here, but let's see what we can do. Knights of the Realm, that should be taken care of. Yeah, let's do it. Let's, let's come out a little bit. Warriors are fleeing. That is not good. It should be okay, I imagine. I think we're okay here. You guys just go straight into there. Where's the Fae? Come on, Fae Enchantress. Let's get involved. I'm going to lose what cavalry forces we had, but I think we'll be okay. Paladin's doing some damage against the hero here, which is nice. The lord there, even. If you guys can recharge straight into the back of them, that would be nice. The got a wee bit of speed. Okay, let's just charge down. Okay, I think we will get you lot there. Crossbowmen there. I've realised I've had my artillery firing the whole time and I didn't notice. Okay. I can just envelope these cavalry to deal with them. Okay, I think we're alright on this side. If you guys could get back, that'd be handy. Hurry! Go on there, okay. That is just going to be a nuisance. So if you can just go take the Lord out, that'd be nice. You're going to break, I imagine. Probably already broken. You need to focus on that. And anybody who's going to be able to reach. You guys just go back up there. You could be last line of defence. Tell you what, if you guys can come forward a little bit. 
Let's get to show these archers what archery is about, eh, with our peasants. This is a bit of a dirty battle, but I think we're doing what we need to do. Are we going to do any damage on this one? Nice. They're not doing overly much damage to me. Oh, now that's what we want to see, isn't it? You're not doing too much yet. Hopefully you'll do a bit more soon, though. The Enchantress. Come involved down here, that'd be nice. In fact, if you can bang off a healing spell there, that'd be nice. Awaken my vengeful brothers. Vengeful mothers? Sure. Spearman at arms. Orders Is he broken? Yeah. I'm sure you kill him. Who's not broken? Is it just the archer still? Okay, you just keep doing some damage to this lot. What sort of range have we got? 100 meters. Ah, just keep going. You get involved as well, you might be able to do some damage on the side. Let's make it go. Okay. You may as well do some healing whilst you're there. And just pop one of these out as well. Come on. Let's kill their prince. I mean, I don't know if he was any good or not anyway, but... I have a thing about killing their lords. Okay, not a, a terribly difficult battle, but... You know, they had probably had better units. I mean, their sea guard units are one of my favourite infantry units in Total War Warhammer. I've never used very well by the... The AI, but God, you can do some damage if you do proper lines of them backed by other archers with cavalry support. Not much will get through that. Some heavily armoured units will do the business, but that's about it. Okay, thank you very much, Fate. We could do with you getting some more magic spells. Life is an interesting one, isn't it? Um, life magic, that is. I mean, life is very interesting as well. I don't think you're on my channel to hear my thoughts on that. But the, the magic... The healing magic's good, but I don't know. It's definitely not my preference. Oh, come on. Yes, you're sending more and more armies. We'll get to the point, my friends. Don't you worry. I'm going to make a distinct point to eliminate almost every single high elf and then subjugate their last province just because they deserve it. They should be living in servitude to us, Bretonians. Oh, the interns are not insubstantial. Oh dear. There's a few errantry. Well, I say errantry. What? There's a few rogue armies, isn't there? What the hell is this? Oh my god. Just got attacked by dwarves. You know what? I'm actually alright with that. I quite like having the dwarves around. Um, oh, Jesus. What's going on here now? So much going on all the time now. It's obviously not a bad thing, but it's starting to become pain. My reputation okay, so me. Belle, if you can get in there. My lady, you honor. need a couple more archers for sure. And then you're almost ready to go out and about, I think. I will Let's get rid of this. My and <coughs> Excuse me. Your... Still can't build Pegasi yet, can I? Pegasus. Pegasi? Pegasi, that was right, sorry. Somebody did tell me that. Um, so really, I'm going to save most of the rest of my money there in Curon so I can upgrade buildings. My strength and um, wisdom are should yours. I attack Montfort? Oh, it could be a difficult one, you know. Hey, what? Do you know who I am? Let's do My this. reputation precedes me. Don't really want to fight this. Oh wait. Why can't I? Ah, oh, okay. I'm being an idiot. Well, if you insist. 
don't really want to fight this battle in this episode, but it might have to happen. No, definitely not fighting that. That actually looks like a far more difficult battle than it's suggesting, but fine. Okay, we will occupy it. There's no point in liberating, liberating Baston, we join us anyway. Okay, killed all of them. If you can come back to Paravon. My first army is getting half decent. Um. Yeah, okay, low border militia. Probably gonna need to get you some more cavalry at some point, but we'll worry about that later. Okay, so we got Montfort back. Oh, God. Yeah, let's spend the money. You're obviously gonna attack Cas Carcassonne, and you probably will take it. So let us just try and fight this battle if you're willing. If you're not willing. I'd like to fight this actually. For the lady. God damn I cowards. I tell you what, I'm going to fight this. Let's do it quickly. Be a good end to the episode. They have archer superiority. Well, yeah, I suppose they do. They've got better range than me. Um, the oh, same range as me, actually. Sorry. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, let's fight. We'll lose a few units needlessly here. But, uh, our men, not units, but... I feel like killing some more filthy elves. That's a little bit racist, but I suppose in the fantasy realm, it might be okay. I don't know. Is it okay? I don't know. Um, okay, I think we'll just do a line. We obviously have better... Art well, they have no artillery, so... Oops. Forgot to do that. I think we'll do our normal... Chase out with my lady. Knights that are still pottering around the knights of the realm, but they're not—they're—they're <coughs> they're not bad. Sorry for the background coughing there. Okay, let's have a little look. You guys stay out there. I mean, Luon, you're—you're you're starting to become a tank, so you can just kind of stay. And attract some fire early on, to be honest. You've got such high missile resistance. Okay, Morgana. It looks really uncomfortable riding a unicorn in that fashion. Now, I mess up with magic all the time, as you guys no doubt know. But I will try and do something here. What about if I stick it there? Will you run into it? Oh, oh, that might be alright, you know. Nice. Oh, yeah. I like to do about 100 kills with Chain Lightning, I feel that's okay. I don't think I'll quite make it with this one. Okay, some Chain Lightning down there. Um, look at the damage gets done to her. Okay, come away, come away. Boom. Did you kill anyone? Nope. Okay, come on. What did I put up there? Oh yeah. I can't remember where I stationed my soldiers. Sorcery. Presume you've done a bit of damage already. Yes, you have. Definitely need some upgrades, though. I need some blessed ones. The liar. Priestess of the lady. Priestess of the lady. You Not the bad lady, though. The good one. one. We'll call the lady the Fae Enchantress. Sure, that's our new lady. I better do my my lore reading because I think I may just said something really obvious there. Um, okay, if you can get back in there. You've got charge defense against all, so I don't think it'll do too much to you. And you know what? Just ping it. You're going to do bugger all to us here. If you guys can get around at the back. What sort of range do we have on this? 100 meters. Look how little damage you do when I've got all this pinged. It's, it's just incredible, isn't it? Okay, lady, if you can just do that, that'd be nice. Go quickly. Boom. Nice. Okay, you are gonna eat. 
Oh, oh, you wee buggers. And that's this battle over down here already, realistically. Okay, if you can get into the Lurian Reavers, you may as well just get into the flank. Oh, I messed up there a little bit. It's okay though. Fae Enchantress. You didn't utilise your my error there in microing. Wasn't superb for that, but we'll deal with that. Okay, down there. No, you get involved. You get involved there. You get involved there. You should just destroy them. Knights of the Rim! Sorry. Um, come on, peasants, fight for me. Oh, look at that. Beautiful damage. You guys just get to the back of them. Okay, I think it's time that you stop firing, I imagine. Um, yeah, you get to them. Doesn't matter how fast you run, archers. You're getting pummeled. You guys are done. You're after that. Leon, you go after them. Okay, I think that's the battle basically over. We don't want you getting away though. I think we'll get Luon back soon. Okay, Luon, I would like you to come after the Prince. You know the, the score here, pal. We like to get rid of them all. As will you come back. You can just stay there. My Knights of the Realm did very well, actually. Um, yeah, you can try and chase. It might be a bit far. Just reduce your armor. At the very least. Okay, I'd like to take one of the Pegasi with me. You guys can go there. You guys go there. I presume you're done. Yep, you're done. Ready for battle. Anyone taking arrow fire? You guys. You you're after them. You guys, and you're after them. Okay. How are you getting on here? Yeah. yeah that's really going to help this situation. We'd like to deal with you. I think we'll get you up here as well. Okay, so that is the archers dealt with. Let's try and kill the prince, just because we hate them all. Oh. Okay. We can do this, can't we? Should be enough cavalry on the field to, to mess up his day. These elves are trying to exterminate me. The only answer to that is to exterminate them first. I'm sure you agree. There we go. Another very decisive victory. 30 losses. Probably a few more than I'd want, but to their 1647, I think we did pretty well. Their archers did pretty much all their damage. A few ones, maybe a two there. Okay, so this has been another episode of trying to mop up the elves. But I feel like we're doing something now. They've still got us on the run a little bit, but we've got enough armies now on the field. Champion of oh, the let's lady. just get rid of you finally. Where it should be fine. We'll go and take Estalia out. Or the elves colonising Estalia. And you that should be in. us down here. I can't imagine them mounting another full expedition against us. Um, let's do lightning strike. You know. Oh, what's this? Let's do lightning strike. Okay, so we have this army. Do you know who I am? We have this army. Albrex is not quite finished, and neither is the Fae Enchantress. But she's definitely stronger than she was. Um, flesh to stone and shield of thorns will be good. Who 
wishes the grave. Can we take you out now? Ever yeah, let's you. just chase. Let's destroy you. Okay, that's another army taken out. Maybe another level up. We're lucky. No, not quite. Okay, come back to Tobara. Tobaro. Um, we've got the Blessing of Lady, which is nice. So they've got Margarita. Balbali will probably be, will definitely be mine next episode. We've still got these stinky elves to deal with. We should be able to take Karak Ziflon maybe the next turn. And I think we will decimate the Waterfall Palace hopefully in the next episode as well, if not the one after that. We've got a bit of mopping up to do here with the Beastmen and stuff hovering around, but I feel like we can manage that. Albrecht will be a force to be reckoned with soon enough. I'd like to get some Pegasi into his force, so that, that's kind of what we're waiting around for. And obviously you've got all these Grail Knights and things. That's 10,000 though, so not too soon. Anyway, folks, that's been another great episode. Please remember to like and subscribe. Please leave a comment. I'm really enjoying the interaction on this series, and I'll try and do as much as what's asked as uh, physically possible. Okay, folks, thank you, and we'll see you again.